What's up, fruit fam? Today, I got some, I don't really know. They're either dates, I think they're dates. These are from uh, Seed Talk OC on Instagram. Uh, I'll link them in the description. I really don't know what these are. I'm gonna try and find out and put them in the description, but we're gonna dig in and, and try them nonetheless. Um, I'm gonna wash them off real quick and then we'll cut them open and we're gonna eat, since I don't know what they are, I think we will eat the skin and we'll eat the seeds. And or if there are any, we'll just, we'll just wing it. All right, I just washed them off. Here they are again. I tossed one of them because it was kind of mushy. Um, but let's cut it open. So they're on like a, a stem kind of thing and you just pick them off. It was like a little cluster of them. And let's see, I froze them so they might, I, I've put them in the fridge so they might be a little hard. Okay, it looks like one large central seed. And if that's the case, we won't eat it. There it is, yeah. One large central seed. So we'll take it out. I think this might be a date, but I also like recall dates being like, like, brown or purple just cutting off where this where it connected to the stem because it's a bit hard but here it is so cutting these open uh the texture they're hard they're kind of hard um that might be because they were in the refrigerator um, but it was kind of like cutting into an apple or, um, you know, something similar. <laughs> Can't think of anything right now. All right, let's, uh, this is Fruit Reviewer going in blind. Whoa. Guys, this is the weirdest thing I've ever had. Um, I think they might be dates. I think I remember reading on the package. It had like a fruit name and I think it was date. I'm just not sure, but I've only ever had them dried. I think that was it. And then these are obviously not dried. Um, it was a bit chewing like, uh, it was a bit like you're chewing on a tiny apple. Um, that really was the texture. It was some, it was crunchy as you might've heard. The flavor really reminds me of sugar cane. Um, I've bought it, I've had, I've like found some sugar cane at Whole Foods in the past and I've tried that. Um, and it's, it's got a sweetness that's really similar to that of sugar cane. And also the texture is kind of, um, it's very fibrous and it is kind of like you're, you're chewing on sugar cane as well. That's really neat, and I really like sugar cane, so no noticeable smell. Let's try it again. There is kind of a um it's sweet, but it's it's mild. It's not an over overbearing flavor, overpowering flavor. Um there is a um ever so slightly like bitter uh chalky component um flavor in there let me see, let me see. yeah the fruit kind of turns like it takes on this like sticky uh powdery ca characteristic where like it sucks up the lubrication in your mouth and it kind of makes your mouth like kind of it's not bitter, but it makes it hard to like, I don't know. It just, it kind of dries up your mouth real quick while you're chewing it. Um, and makes kind of your, and in, in, in drying up your mouth, it makes it hard to, um, kind of makes your mouth sticky a little bit. <laughs> yeah. It makes your whole mouth like sticky. It really does have the texture of sugar cane. It's really interesting. It's got this very interesting property. Really nice. 
So it's sugary, and I would describe it as cane sugar. The, the type of sugar is like cane sugar. I had no idea these were what dates were. Like I've only had the dry, I've had dried dates and they look nothing like this. Got it. <laughs> Very chewy. Very crunchy. There are a few bitter bits in there. Actually, I, I think there are. I don't know why, what causes it. Maybe it's just one that I cut up. It's like underripe or something. Anyways, there you go. Dates. Hope you liked it.